passes. Congratulations. And with that vote, dining in Avondale comes with a few more freedoms. Post Office Pies owner John Hall believes the new entertainment district designation will boost his bottom line. It's really huge for us, especially just dealing with uh, COVID-19. Uh, it helps uh, just get more foot traffic and flow down to our area. As an entertainment district, Avondale can get permission to close down streets for a district-wide block party. Plus, patrons can finish their drink while on an evening stroll. Folks want to grab a drink to go on one end of the street and walk down to the other to have dinner or to come see a concert. Um, allows you to do that, which hopefully will increase revenues for all of the merchants. Birmingham's fourth entertainment district will stretch three blocks on 41st Street from Fancy's on 5th here on 5th Avenue down to Avondale Brewing on 2nd. City Councilor Hunter Williams is not worried about increased public intoxication risks. We've actually seen no problems to date with the other three entertainment districts. Avondale Brewing's Taylor Lander thinks it could lure more visitors to Birmingham. I think this kind of ups the ante for us to be on the same playing field as in New Orleans or Memphis. It just creates more of a festive atmosphere to be able to walk around and enjoy yourself. Under Alabama law, the city can still set up one more entertainment district. In Birmingham, John Papke, WVTM 13.